girl, listen, $105 for a headband wig. There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, you guys? It's Friday, but like, really, I don't even know when I'm gonna post this video up. But girl, I'm feeling rather cute. Hello, feeling rather cute today. I got a couple of comments and some messages asking me where I am getting these cute off the shoulder shirts from. I only had on two in the last most recent videos, but I wore these shirts for like the past couple of years now. So you might see them sporadically in videos. They're actually from several different websites, but they all sister websites. So Rose Gal, Zafu, um, they're from those websites. I like those websites. You need to check the sizing chart before you purchase anything from those websites. This one that I have on is a 3X. Like, you know, you gotta be checking them sites, girl. But you know, they're comfortable. And I just think like showing a shoulder is so sexy. Sexy shoulder, you know. But you know what I'm saying? So anyway, you guys, I hope you guys are having like a really great week. I got some new lighting here going on. This was not like a planned thing. Let me let me tell y'all something. Nothing is ever planned with me. I die, yeah, most of the time. I was in a Savers Thrift Store this week because, yeah, this week because it's Friday. And Monday they have 50% off of everything in Savers. Like, okay, every single thing. Found this mirror. I'm not, excuse me, mirror light. And I was like, what is this? Like, I really did not know what it was, okay? But you can test stuff out. I tested it out. And the, the light bulb in it was kind of dull. It was like a yellowish color. But let me tell y'all. $2.50 later. Because like I said, everything is half off up on Mondays. I came home with me a nice light. I'm going to instill a picture in it. But I did change it to a 60 wattage daylight. And like, girl, let's look. It makes like a huge, not a huge difference, but it makes like a nice difference. But yeah, so, you know, we're going to get into this video. Um, I've never worked with this company ever in my life. Listen, I've never even heard of them. The website is called BGM Girl, BGM Girl. When I looked it up after I received the whip, I was like, what does this stand for? It actually stands for Black Girl Magic. I did not know that we was magical, but or like Houdini's. I like to consider myself magical at times. Like, you know, when I snap my fingers, my kids will have like my, my dinner ready, my bills paid, they will all behave, you know, stuff like that. I, I feel like when I snap my fingers, my whole face should be made up with makeup. I don't really have to do much. That's the type of magic that I'm talking about. I snap my fingers and a whole bag of money is sitting right in front of me. That's what I'm talking about. That's the magical type of stuff I be trying to do. But with that being said, I'm going to show you how your unit comes from Black Girl Magic, BGM Girl. And then we're going to just jump right into this. When you receive your unit from BGM Girl Hair, they'll come in their pink standard box. You'll also receive a stock card, which will ask you to share with love. You can enjoy a discount code. You can also share your photos on their social media. BGM Girl will provide a pair of their 3D Ming hair eyelashes. These lashes are very full. They'll also provide a two-piece wig cap, which you can use to protect your hair. For additional costs, there are also headbands on the website. These beautiful wide headbands will provide a great camouflage for the nape area if you do prefer to wear your unit up in an updo, ponytail, half up, half down. The unit that I received is a 20 inch, 200% density volume headband unit. This unit comes in many different origins, such as Brazilian, Peruvian, Malaysian, and Indian texture. And this is their body wave. 
believe it or not, the prices on BGM Girl are very affordable. $105 for this unit is absolutely amazing. I would state you will need to co-wash your unit when receiving it, as it did look a little dry at the ends. Once I co-washed it, the hair came out really, really soft. As for the headband, it is very stretchy and is easy to wear. I'll make sure to post all of the information down below as they have many, many affordable units that I'm sure you'll want to check out. So as you guys see, this is super easy. It does come with the combs, but I'm just going to just place it up against my cornrows as well as that as I'm just going to take these two flaps, these Velcros, and I'm just going to tighten that. There isn't any adjustable straps in the nape area, but that's okay because with the Velcro straps, you can make it as tight as you want. And as I stated, the unit, I did co-wash it as the ends did look a little dry. And once I co-washed it and allowed my conditioner to sit on the unit for about 30 minutes, the hair was a lot more softer and more manageable. So I would highly suggest that. Now I'm really not sure about these short hairs, but I'm thinking that they're just there to put a little bit of volume density in the unit, which is supposed to be 200. I really don't feel like this is 200%, but hey, we're going to see how it do, boo. I'm loving these headbands, okay? I've just had to say it like that because they're so easy. Like, guys, you guys already know what a headband wig is. It's just a half wig with a headband sewn onto it. But if it makes life easier for you, then I say go for it. For the price of this one, like, listen, you can't go wrong. But we're going to jump into the rest of this video. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. Everything Okay, so first I want to say this. I was not like a really huge fan of these headbands. Like I see like a lot of girls wear them and sometimes it just makes me feel like they have like a Saturn, you know, the planet Saturn. Like they got like a Saturn ring on their head. Like some of them look just like so bulky and big. And I think it is depending on how the hair is styled. If the hair is not full and fluffed up, it just really looks like you have like a freaking piece of round foam on your head. Like I just really can't get past these. And I was sent um, several of these and I'm just like, let me just try this out today because I really want to see what it looks like. Like I'm not like a huge fan of these. Like I always like for my headbands to lay flat and that's just me. But for some reason, like I think it has to do with the hair because if I was to just put it back like this, I just, I don't know. I feel like I have like this, this queen crown on. I, I was never like a huge fan of these headbands. The sad thing about it is they are so pretty. Like they put so much time and work and effort into these headbands. They look so cute. Like you cannot tell me this headband is not bomb as hell. But when I see them on some of the girls, I'm like, girl, that is way too big for your head. Like, where are you wearing that to? That's what I was thinking. For some reason, this one looks cute. Um, It's the same size as the other ones. I don't know what it is, but you know, in my house, we don't be wearing these. We, we don't. We just don't wear these. Okay. But we're going to go on to the next headband because I'm just trying to give y'all options of headband. I mean, like this look really cute and sexy stuff, especially with the shoulder off. Like, hello, girl. It really did send me some really, really cute ones. You know, I did um, receive three, which was the yellow, the tie dye, and the cheetah print. I really do like these headbands, especially because they're wide all the way around. Perfect camouflage headband. Now, also, the really cool thing about these headbands is, you know, it has two layers. Switch it around kind of like in the back where you see the seam at. If you put it to where the actual seam is, like right here, you see the seam? Like, you know. The sewing part, the seam, the headband is going to change all together in the front. It's going to give you like a knotted look in the front. It gives you like a knotted look in the front, which I like because it all depends on your head shape, but it gives you like this little knotted look. If you switch it to where the seam cannot be seen, you know, you just take this one that's on the inside and flip it over and just take the one on the outside and just turn it. Then you're getting like a totally different headband as well lays really really flat but i like it both ways i like it with or without the knot because they're just really fashionable there are so many different varieties of these headbands like girl i'm going crazy i don't know how many i have in my collections but i'm loving them now this one i purchased okay on my own from five below they have the thinner back i like these and of course this one definitely matches what i'm rocking today but we're gonna try out the other one too Love you. i can't take no more Girl, I think I'm losing my mind Try to go to work, but I lost track of time Cause everyone keep looking like you I can't take no more I miss your touch From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone 
see the difference in how you fold the headband or lay them it will give you like a totally different style so for this hair i did notice that there are little pieces of short hair in between the tracks and i'm honestly thinking that this is probably to make the hair look a little bit fuller. Now, each company has like so many different headband wigs. Like there are so many headband wigs out now and each company has their own version. The middle comb was not by the headband per se, but up back a little bit, which is kind of like a good thing because I did notice that the ones where the comb in the middle is right here, it kind of starts to hurt. I don't really use that one. I try not to use the combs in general. I have two cornrows in my hair and then a wig cap. It's not moving. It's the cornrows that are stopping it from budging back on the headband. So it kind of works out. I did notice with this company that their Velcro is on the opposite side. Like the longer side is normally on the right side. And that little square piece is on the left. But it's total opposite. They don't have adjustable straps in the nape. That's okay too because you have the headband Velcro which will actually make it tighter. The actual headband itself is somewhat almost the same fabric but it is a little bit thinner on the thinner side. So I'm not really sure if that's going to make the difference in the durability and longevity of the wig. But this one is also knotted as well in the front and I do see these a lot at your local Dollar Trees. These are also thinner on the back but they are also knotted in the front. One is knotted but sewn together knotted so you can't see the separation. So this wig is 200% um, density. This one for 20 inches is really, really cheap, okay? Like, girl, listen, $105 for a headband wig versus $300. Like, I'm all for the headband wigs from any company because I love them. If you can save you some coins, go ahead. So for $105, this is the lowest that I've seen it for. I'm not seeing any issues with this. The only thing that I really didn't care for was like the little short hair in between a couple of tracks. Now as for being 200% density, I'm not really sure if I'm seeing that, but it's still really a great deal. And it comes in Brazilian, Peruvian, Malaysian, and Indian hair texture. It's a very, very inexpensive wig for the price. So I'm definitely gonna say go this for it. This is the one, like a knotted one. And I actually get these two from the Dollar Tree. Can't get enough when you're sweet talking to me. Now I'm talking sweet all by myself. Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me. What you need from me, need your love on me, put your love on me. I'm gonna do everything for you. I don't want anyone but you. Put your arms around me. Black Girl Magic, honey. It came out really nice. I'm liking the affordable price. Go get you a headband wig. Like, seriously, it came out decent. It fits good. Like, I really can't complain. It's a headband wig. So, it's not like you got to bleach it or anything like that. You cannot go wrong for this price. All of the information will be down below. And on that note, a girl has got to go. I'll see you guys in another video.